Okay. He should move my scatter. Here we go. See? Okay. Um, this is Maybelline. Maybelline makes good mascara. i just put a little bit now. I don't know about you, but I have a problem. I can't do that whole thing and wiggle and, you know, keep applying. So I want to put some on. I have long eyelashes to begin with, so I'm going to put some on the bottom too. Just a little bit, not too much. I don't know, but putting a lot in the bottom is just like spider webs or something, or creepy crawlies. So, just put a little bit. And now once this dries, I'm going to hit it with... The hell did it go? Yeah. Hi. I'm going to hit it with eyelash color. And girls, these things can be dangerous. If you go too close to your eye, you're actually going to take off your eyelid. Well, not take it off, but you're going to... It's going to hurt. You'll feel it. So, try to get as close as possible, but without going for your eyeball or your eyelid okay so that's gonna be it so you'll feel it like I feel a little bit of a tug and a stop and this does make my eye my eyes tear so I'll probably need my little puffy I'm just gonna give it a couple of taps and you can hold it for a little bit and open it or gentle of course my eyes are tearing have no fear, water mascara is here. And no, your bottom makeup should not get affected, but it might. And if it does, hit it again, go over it again, no problem. Let me see. And my eyelashes will stay cur curled this way, but if I do it without the eyelash curl, forget it. Forget it. Okay, now we're going to put just, um, just a little bit of blush, because if you just leave it like this, you want it to look too blah. I mean, I know the day is blah out, but you don't want to really match it too much. You know, but I just got, I don't know, this feeling just a little, a little bit of grays today and not too over carried away with makeup because if you get stuck in the rain and that shit hits your eyes and you work on that, forget it. And you didn't put no primer on or it's starting to come off? Yeah. And there's a hot guy? Yeah. Oh, hot girl, you know, whatever. So I put a little bit, it's just a very pale pink, not too much, and so we, we all know the rule follow, do the fish face, and just slightly, like sometimes I'm going to start the emotion, just a little bit, just a dab, you know, I don't know if you can really see it, but I'll show you afterwards some photos, because my lighting in here is just fantastic, as you can see, there is no friggin' light, okay. Same here. Give yourself just a little bit, just a little pink cheek. Not, you know, a little bit of a rosy cheek, just a dab. Just give a little bit of color, because you don't want to look pale and blah like outside, you know. When it's raining out and gloomy. Sometimes I like to put a little bit here and here. Infamous T zone. Just a little bit. Not too much in the chin. Okay. See? Okay, we're gonna finish off with some cheap lip liner and oh cheap old lipstick and listen, I have my Mac, okay? Yes, I went shopping today for Mac. I stopped up and ran out of my infamous uh, Nuru. Um, but I want to do cheap styles first. Maybe we'll get into Mac later on. We'll see. So I just have like a pink for it. It's just a very pale pink. I don't even know if you can see that. Something very pale, very a light for us. Just a hint. Nothing too crazy. Okay, I'm just going to do a quick eyeliner tip. You know, eyeliner. A quick lip line. Really fast, because this is very, very sheer. It's very pale. If you go above your lip line, it doesn't even matter. Look, see? Oh my god, it could be so messy. Nobody will notice with this one. Don't be that messy. I'm exaggerating, but. Maybe you want to fill in a little bit. It's just a hint. Now, go with a um, cheap 
frosty, just any type of pink frosty thing. My lips, excuse me, my lips are a little bit dry. So, actually, the lipstick is helping it, but you could put some Vaseline before, just a little bit, just to, you know, get them a little bit soft. Not have that ring effect they have to go on around, you know. It's like, where has your mouth been going? Ew. And that's it. Let's put it dab. Hopefully I don't have a biggie in my nose. Um, just my lips are dry. Um, you can do that little trick where you stick your finger. No, don't stick your finger in your nose where it doesn't belong, but stick it in your mouth. Ah, uh, uh, close it, and then pull it out. Like so. And... You should get some on your finger, but it'll help with that. You ever get that icky ring here? It's like nasty. It means like a white residue. Or don't be thinking what I'm thinking. And I shouldn't be thinking what I'm thinking. But anyways, um, yeah, let me just shut up. This is the look. I'm going to put some pictures. Hopefully you like it. It's very delicate. It's nice. You can wear it wherever you want. Um easier to take off too because the heavier the makeup you apply the more you'll be able to makeup remover and baby wipes and makeup makeup remover wipes and all that and um washing your face so that's that and see you guys in next time bye bye